Progressive meshes are a useful tool for controlling level of detail in complex meshes. Texture mapping is an efficient scheme for adding the appearance of surface detail to geometry. In this paper, we describe the first automatic system for creating texture maps for progressive meshes. The problem is to create a parametrization of the entire progressive mesh sequence using a single texture. Here is a result of using a normal map texture, which preserves the appearance of geometric detail. These textured progressive meshes can also be geomorphed by interpolating the texture coordinates. In constructing the parametrization and the progressive mesh sequence, we have two goals. The first is to minimize texture stretch to evenly distribute texture samples on the surface. The left image shows the texture sampling pattern of a uniform edge spring parametrization. Stretched hexagons indicate regions that will have sparse texture samples. The right image shows the more balanced sampling pattern obtained using our stretch minimizing parametrization. When these parametrizations are used to sample surface textures, undersampling in high stretch regions results in blurriness, as seen on the fingers of the model. Our second goal is to minimize texture deviation, or sliding of the texture over the progressive mesh. Again, in this comparison, the progressive mesh on the left is constructed with a uniform edge spring parametrization. On the right, we show the result of our optimized parametrization. Note that the texture sliding is less evident on the right. We now present a high-level overview of our system. The first stage partitions the original mesh into disk-like regions called charts. Unlike previous methods, our method is automatic, adjusts to the surface geometry, and introduces no extra edges in the mesh. We create charts by successfully merging faces using a metric that measures both planarity and compactness of the resulting charts. Since each chart will map to a polygon in texture space, we want the chart boundaries to be as straight as possible. We accomplish this using a simple shortest path algorithm. For each chart, we find its stretch minimizing parametrization over a convex polygon. Next, we simplify the mesh by finding a sequence of edge collapses that minimizes the texture deviation on this parametrization. This is followed by a final nonlinear optimization of the parametrization that minimizes both stretch and deviation. After establishing the parametrization and simplification sequence, we pack the polygonal charts into a square image using a heuristic algorithm. We then sample the texture from the fine geometry using this parametrization. Finally, in order to reduce mipmap artifacts, we apply a pull-push algorithm to fill in the empty regions of the texture. And here is the resulting texture mapped model. Now we show a number of progressive meshes textured automatically using our system. In these examples, the geometry of the original high-resolution mesh was used to normal map the model. In conclusion, we have demonstrated an automatic system for creating an atlas parametrization common to all levels of a progressive mesh. Unlike previous approaches, our scheme simultaneously optimizes texture stretch and texture deviation, resulting in a parametrization that evenly distributes samples over the surface and provides geometric fidelity.